Christ will be coming and then we'll have his own army surrounding people in the near Damascus there. Then Jibreel or sorry uh, Isa alayhi salam will be descending down to that even near the minaret of the near the minaret near near that mosque and we'll be coming on the like on the wings of angels will be coming down not just that and as well he will be coming to the extent that our prophet ﷺ described him that he will come as if he took just now a shower that's his his uh, will find drops of water will be dropping then he will come in to the mosque where the people the believers will be praying and then he will be led by the one who pray who was praying then after that he will rule then after that when he goes out the antichrist will see him will start like melting like a butter and then he will run away from him then isa <coughs> let me finish <coughs> jesus will jesus will follow him until he will find him near the well of lead in palestine and then he will kill, kill him there then he will rule on earth for 40. 40 what could be 40 days 40 months 40 years tell, tell me how will you recognize who is jesus and who is the antichrist because it will be the believers will be recognized the antichrist will run away antichrist is a disbeliever is the antichrist uh, uh, lucifer is he what? Satan? Oh, Satan? no who is he a, 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 a man a giant man and uh, you know a giant man giant man okay, okay. and he is one eyed uh, one eyed a one eyed giant man he's the antichrist and he wants to kill Jesus. no he came to 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 kill muslims to the believers then then when Jesus will be coming, Jesus will kill him. Oh, you will kill him. Okay, this is, uh, I've never heard this story before. Yeah, that's mission in our yeah. Those are things. Right? So how do you know that the person that's coming and he says he's Jesus, how do you know it's going to be him? Because the believers will recognize him. He will be known. He's a prophet. Firstly, no, not feeling. He will come down on the wings of angels. What do you think? Someone will come sending down. And he will be aware the believers will be at a time in a peak. And he will come and they will recognize him as a prophet. Everyone. And even he was he's described. How is he described in the in the Quran and Sunnah and Sunnah of the Prophet? He's described. And he's described the details. Can you imagine that his 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 hair will be dropping water? This is how much he was described. This is how much we have detailed description about him. You see, this is a, this is a problem because the, the Christians believe Jesus is going to come back, but he's not going to touch the earth. No, he'll, no, he'll come back, not just touch it, he will be ruling. Yeah, the, the Christians believe at the second coming, he comes in the clouds, and the people that go to heaven actually go up. And then he just doesn't go to heaven. And he but the Christians also believe that the Satan is going to come back and impersonate, impersonate no. Jesus. And no, that's you'll, a, be, you'll be living on the earth and you'll say, I'm the king, I'm Jesus, I've come to save him. No, that's Antichrist, but that's not Lucifer. That's not Lucifer at all. That's not uh, devil. It's, it's, a, it's a giant man, as I said to you. He's a human being. And he is a great giant man. So this is what I'm telling you from the Bible in, in Revelation. It says that, that Lucifer will come and say, I'm Jesus. Jesus but that's not our point. Our point is not what the what the Bible or what the other scriptures say. Our point yeah, is no, what they say. Do you believe in God yourself? Sorry? Do you believe in God? I do, yeah, of course, there has to be a God because how do you... How are you Christian? Are you Christian? Oh, I'm Christian, yes. You, 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 you follow Christianity? I don't follow a denomination. I don't follow do you believe Jesus is God? Jesus is the son. He says he's the son of God. What do you mean by son of God? Like David was son of God, like Moses was son of God. But you know, this is insertion in the Bible too, begotten. That's, this wording is insertion in the Bible. Why didn't you why didn't you accept that Jesus he said about himself he was sent by God so he isn't God he was not God when you say son again son of God it could be the meaning servant of God like other prophets and messengers of God they are servants of God they serve what God is telling, telling them that's why what they do no, actually, you see here, that's my point is, my point is, Islam is teaching you in a clear statement, who is God, who is Jesus, who is the prophets, the prophets of God, they will never be like God, and they don't have the description sons of God, they are description of servants. Servants, servants of God.
What nonsense is this? Yeah. So, now, have you read the Quran before? I'm starting to read just a little bit, like in the beginning. I haven't, um, uh, maybe uh, a quarter. If Islam makes sense to you, will you accept to be Muslim? I want to know the truth, you know, because there only can be one truth. True, I agree with you. Yeah. If there is one truth, do you think it should have false? The truth, does it have any falsehood? See, that's a problem because it's, it's very hard to find the no, truth. Before we were very hard, let's accept, let's have this concept, let's have this agreement. Okay. If Islam makes sense to you, will you accept to be Muslim? Uh, I want to find the truth. I don't believe Islam I'm, I'm say, is... Uh, before, before you believe or not, I'm saying if Islam makes sense to you and it has the truth. I'm not, I'm not uh, saying I'm going to convert or anything like that. I want to know... Okay, well, hold on a second. If Islam is the truth, will you accept to be Muslim? If Christianity is the truth, you'll be... Christianity definitely is not the truth because it has many falses and I will I will explain this to you and then if you have any falses in Islam let's let's discuss it yeah it, now as you said the truth has one one way there is no different ways now the question is to you again if Islam has the truth will you accept to be Muslim before on condition that, that you follow the truth as well of course on condition we follow we both follow the truth yeah all right you accept you accept this condition we both have to follow the truth, correct? Yeah, yeah. I'm just here to question. I understand. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen. Before talking about conversion, you know, don't be reluctant to accept the truth. If there is truth, you have to accept it, correct? If there is truth, you have to accept it. Yeah? You have to accept it. Don't be, you know, vague. Like, just simple. If there is a truth, you have to accept it, correct? Or we don't accept the truth. Obviously depends on what you're going to say. Before what I leave what I'm saying, I'm not talking about what I'm saying. I'm yeah. saying if there is truth, me and you have to follow it, correct? If you believe that, that uh, let's say, Jesus, you, you convince that Jesus is the Son of God, will you become a Christian? Before we come to the Son of God, I will come to the point now okay. here. My point is, yeah. if, if something is the truth, me and you have to follow it, correct? So, so for example, if you know it is the truth, even though you will not follow it. Let's agree on certain concepts. Otherwise, we're going to be all over the place. If there is the truth, me and you will follow it. Correct? Look, it obviously depends. You know, like if 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 there's there's something. Listen, when when I say truth, an objectively truth, not subjectively truth. For example, the existence of God, yeah? Yes, it is an objectively God. truth, correct? That's my point. Well, you, it's, it's objectively truth to us. To so authors. Some people have leave, leave what the, some people let's are. Say, let's say the guy is an atheist. You come say, I'm just saying, listen, listen, listen. Before you we say, go to. You say to me, show me God. I can't show you God. You can't show you God. So then you say, but then how do I believe in God if I can't see him? That's a different matter. Listen to me and listen again. If there is, if there is truth, objectively truth, we'll follow it. Okay. So. Okay. okay let, let's let's agree on certain things. I believe there is God, but let's say I'm an atheist. I say, show me God. Listen. Now, now you are. We're we now going away from the point. We're talking about an objectively truth. The sun is blue. Objectively the truth. You understand? We have to follow that. The sun is there. Everyone can see it. So okay, the sun is there. Everyone can see it. The sky is blue. So that's my point. I'm talking about this. We believing in God by faith. Wow. Why do you argue on something which is a trivial thing? It is simple. If there is something, listen, listen. My one brother, just a minute. Listen to me. Can't focus. Everything else that you I say, you can see it. My point, I, listen, I listen to me. I have a ball in my hand, you can't see it, so it's not the truth. So listen to me. We're not talking about fake things. We're talking about and something that's objectively truth. You understand? That's what Do I'm you saying. understand what means objectively truth? Means yeah. everyone agrees that this is something according true. According to religion or according to science? And everything. <laughs> Because according to religion, God is, is, is... Why do you argue on something trivial? It's simple. It's something objectively truth. We'll follow it or not. Objective truth. You're saying God exists, so show me God. So you don't believe in God? 
Okay, let's discuss. Okay, then why we discuss this now? Because you're saying objective truth. So Ma leave what other? Me and you, okay. we have an objectively truth, the existence of God. Okay, okay. okay. So we move past. We're saying, we're saying God okay. exists. We assume God exists. You assume I believe God exists. I believe as I, I, I believe in God more than I believe that I exist, I myself. I believe in the existence of God more than my existence. I, you understand? You see, uh, I believe in God because I can see God's creation. That's my point. The, I but before. See God. My point is, why we are going this? That's not our point. Okay. Our point is, if there is something objectively truth, we'll follow it. That's my point. Yeah, we would, we could bring monkeys. They don't think we're not talking. We're talking about this this topic. Let's focus on this. Now, the next question: If there is something that is truth, it shouldn't have falsehood. Correct. Good. So, if I brought you some mistakes. Uh, uh, and uh, uh, a trivial mistakes, a significant mistakes in the Bible. Will you say it's still it's a word of God? Uh, I've looked at all the mistakes in the Bible. There's about ten of them. They are trivial, very trivial. Like uh, who was Jesus's uh, father, or not his father? He's uh, Grandfather, or something. Grandfather. They're trivial. It's just the name. It doesn't change. No, I'm talking about trivial, trivial in the faith, in the faith, not trivial as a faith, as something faith which it has mistakes. For example, now, do you believe Bible has the uh, it is absolute truth from God? I'm not talking about the translation. I'm talking about things which is not, not mistakes of translation. I'm talking about facts. So I believe, yeah, I believe the Bible is, is, a, is an accurate depiction of what actually happened in history. Good. This, this book over here. Good, good. I want, to, I want to talk about history. I'm talking about history. Okay. According to the Bible, where the Bible was the main source of history before, in the past, especially about the ancient Egypt, correct? Okay, I will ask you, and from your understanding and from the Bible, what was the name of the king at the time of Moses? The king of the time of Moses. The Egyptian king at the time of Moses. Egyptian king at the what was his title? Of, uh, Moses. Uh, there were two. There were... Pharaoh, Pharaoh, Pharaoh. Pharaoh, yeah, I'm trying to think because there was the Ramses. We're not talking about Ramses, we're talking about just the title, not the name, the title of the king. The title of the king. No, 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 the title. The title of someone, a leader, the pharaoh. Pharaoh. Yeah. Like the title of the king in the Roman Empire is uh, Caesar. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. You understand? Yeah. The title of the king in, in, in Japan in Japan is emperor. Yeah. So yeah. the title. Yeah. Or they used to call as well in, in Mongolia Shah, whatever. Yeah? yeah. So he was the pharaoh. 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 Yeah. Okay. And what was the title of the king at the time of Joseph? In Egypt, from the Bible. Uh, Pharaoh. So Pharaoh the same. So Pharaoh was at the time of Joseph. Pharaoh was the time of Moses, and there is around thousand thousand year in gap between them around that time. Uh, from Moses to who? To Joseph. Joseph. Yeah. Moses to Joseph. You're saying it's a thousand years. I don't know. It's something like that. Okay. Okay. But that's not my point. That's not my point. How many years there were? My point is, 100 years ago, an Englishman from this country went and studied the ancient Egyptian hieroglyphic language. And then they found something called risotto stone. Have you heard about it? Yes, And then from that, they dismantled the, they do the, the, translation. the, the translation of the language from old hieroglyphic language into old Greek language to the Latin language. Yeah? And then they discovered when they were studying from pyramids, from all over the place, from the temples, from the, uh, even the, the scrolls that they found, they found that the title of the, ti the time of Moses, Pharaoh, no problem. But it is impossible for the, for the title of the king at the time of Joseph to be called Pharaoh. Impossible. Why it's impossible? Because during that time, Hexos, which is a Mediterranean rain, they ruled Egypt. They took over Egypt during that time. When they took over Egypt, they never used title pharaohs at all. They didn't use title pharaohs. 
They used to call themselves kings, not pharaohs. And that's why it is a significant error to call the, that king as pharaoh. Now, when it comes to Islam, so that's a, that is an, an error in history. And I will tell you why it's a significant error. When Islam came 1400 years ago, you will find the story of Moses scattered around the Quran. So the sometimes talking about Moses and King uh, Moses and Pharaoh, Pharaoh and, uh, and Moses, etc., and Moses and Aaron and Pharaoh, all these things. And there is one single chapter in the Quran talking about the story of Joseph, just one chapter. But the tone of the Quran, when it comes to the story of Joseph, the tone of the Quran changed from Pharaoh suddenly talking about a king. And Joseph and the king, King and Joseph, in many places in that chapter. So in the past, Christian used to come to us, you say, you have error in the Quran. Look at the king, he should be Pharaoh. We said, if God said so, we accept it, no problem. Yeah? So we leave this. Until this discovery confirms that Islam was right on this, in the historical fact that the, the king at the time of Joseph to be called to king, and the king at the time of Moses to be called Pharaoh. And it is actually, if you go to historian, someone who studied history, ancient Egyptian history, if you say to them, by the way, Pharaoh ruled during the time of Joseph, we'll laugh at you. We'll laugh at you. They said, what's, what's, this, what's this nonsense? Just like, for example, for example, the kings or the kings of, um, in, in England, of England, for example, and the queen maybe sometime, they ruled, they ruled Egypt at a certain point. They were under colonization. They were kind of took over Egypt. When they took over Egypt, they never said about her or them, pharaohs. They never said that. They still call kings. This, this, uh, this story doesn't really bring much significance because whoever it was, it was the pharaoh or the king. It doesn't really matter. They Can you? As, as the root, okay. You know? Why? Why? So why? That if that's like, if that's matter. Why Jesus, when he said, give what's for Caesar for Zephyr and get what uh, for God what's for God? Yes, he said this. Why he didn't say give what's for Pharaoh for Pharaoh and what's for the God for God? Why he used Caesar, he didn't use Pharaoh? If it's not significant. Yeah, but the thing is, the thing is, uh, the, thing is the Bible has been translated from... No, no, well, we're not talking about the translation. Yes, no, no, no. Uh, uh, into English and to different languages. No, so no. if they use the word Pharaoh or they use... No, 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 no. We're not talking, no, we're not talking about translation. But you know what it means. It means no, 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 no. So, we are not talking. No, we are not talking about translation. It doesn't change the story of the Bible. No, it changed. It change if the, you the say that uh, Joseph was there. No, no, no. It doesn't. Do you know what I'm it saying? Changed. It changed. No, it changed. It changed. I will tell you how. Okay. If you say now, I give allegiance to Charles, Charles the Third, the Caesar of England, the Caesar of UK. They say, what, what, what's this? What do you? What, what's Caesar? What's Caesar? Then what, who told? What's, what's, what's this nonsense? The point is that this something, it is a significant error to say it in, in a place where the, that title is not used for that person. Oh, the okay. same thing, yeah. now going back, the same thing, why Jesus didn't say, so one second. One, one thing about other king, they use other word king or pharaoh. But they pharaoh, pharaoh, no, they use, no, they use specifically pharaoh. pharaoh. They but, use but it. You know this, this, this. Studies over, and this is it time. doesn't matter. Can you say about King, king Charles is the president of UK? I'm just saying, this is, you, you say, say, say this. One thing to debunk the entire Bible. You say, oh, okay. No, 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 I'm talking about an error. When, listen, yeah, an you, error, you, you brought the history. Saying, oh, it's an error. Listen, you brought the history. I didn't bring the history. Listen. Listen, yeah, okay, listen. It's fine, but it, you, it's not a big, it's not like something like, wow, okay. Jesus what, one second, one second. You know, or something to that effect. No, no, I will tell you. You, you know, brought, I, I wanna, by I wanna, the way, by I talk to me because I, you could, could, I could address yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. But that's rude, by the way, if I address people while I'm talking to you. You came to talk to me. How did you think yeah, yeah. yeah. So the point is, you mentioned yeah. about historical fact. Okay. Historical and, fact that they what's found the in the Red Sea, they found that because, because Pharaoh's army chased Moses, right, through the Red Sea. We they agree. No problem. We have no issues with this. That's not our problem. It's we confirm. No, 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 not the Red Sea. Chariots in it's, the Red Sea. We we uh, confirm. We confirm. We confirm yeah. as Muslims that Allah 
has destroyed the people of Pharaoh in the in the in the sea. Which sea we don't know, but uh, we know. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's not our point. My point is, when we are when you are talking about fact, historical fact, it should not have errors. When you talk about historical fact, if you now, if you study history, if you want to do a research in history about the ancient Egypt and say during the Hexos time, pharaohs of the Hexos used to do this, they will fail you. They will fail you big time. Why? Because Hexos never used the title pharaohs, never ever used the title pharaohs. So the point is, if it's academically error, if it's historically error, it is as well if it comes to the matter of faith. You need to show me the biggest error in the Bible. That's a big. Greek, that's a. That's Greek that shows. That shows. I'm not talking to you. No. I'm not talking. I'm not talking to you. I'm not no, talking. I'm not no, talking to you. No, I'm Hizos not talking to you. We're not the Pharaoh. Yeah. The Hesus were not. Yeah. Pharaoh. Yeah. The Hesus were not Pharaohs. Yeah, biggest, my, my point is, Pharaoh, Hexos, not, not Pharaohs, yeah, yeah. but the Bible. They, they, adopted, they adopted the title. No, they didn't adopt the title. They adopted it. No. Maybe Satan. They didn't use it. The, the word Satan is even okay. from the. By, by the way, by the way, by the way. By the way, I didn't allow you. I did, I, we yeah, didn't allow the you. Word to, Satan. By the way, by the way. Okay, I think you could have your discussion there. We, I'm not, I'm not in need of your discussion. Okay. They, they, they drive away. You see here. It's history. It's history. Okay. It's history. It's history. Yeah. If you study the history of the Egyptians, ah, mashallah, كيف حال هو يا أخي رد زك الله خير رد سير زك الله خير بارك زك الله خير الحمد لله الله الحمد لله زك الله خير يمكن. Huh? Well, you you should do the test. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remind me, remind me. I I don't see you. I don't see, didn't see you. This is the first time I'm seeing you. Subhan. Subhan. Ah, Allah ibarik. Zakallah khair. Subhan. MashaAllah. Allah merah. Allah ya khair. Because I see a lot of people. Zakallah khair. Yes. I want to ask. I want to ask about the books we're doing. But I'll ask later. Yeah, inshallah. Just let me finish. Okay. I think. Listen. I think if you wanted to have your discussion. Yeah. Egypt, yeah, he invaded Egypt. You know, he ran away okay. from Egypt before he made a coup against the Okay. By the way, by the way, uh, they have this, they have their own separate discussion. Okay, so you could you could finish your separate discussion. Listen. They were not African, they were not black. Yeah, okay. You, you could, yeah. Yeah, that's my point. Yeah. So they never used title pharaohs. They adopted it. So Latun, Farua, even there was a name in the Bible called okay. fucking Falu. Okay. The the word Satan. Going back. Satan is even from them. Yeah. Listen, the listen. No, no, no. There are other. There are, there, are there are other. They are all okay. They are Bible, okay. the Quran. They are all mistakes. So, there are many. Uh, you mentioned, you, you said to me. They are all mistakes. Listen. What's this? You, I don't know. The Bible and the Quran. They are all mistakes. They are all Who's this guy? Who's this guy? What do you want? They are all mistakes. Okay, what do you want? What do you want? No, 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 I don't need anything. What do you want? I don't need anything. What did you, what did you interfere in this discussion? No, because what you normally listen, say, listen. are all wrong. Listen, listen. They are all rubbish. Okay, okay. They are wrong. Talk about yourself. The Hesos, the Hesos invaded Egypt. They are Semitic people. They are Asia. Semitic people. That's what you are talking. There is an arrow in the Quran. That is an arrow okay, in the Quran. Okay, going back. Listen, you could have a discussion. Okay, listen. After this, they I will have... Egypt. One of their kings who invaded Egypt at that time. I'm only first. Okay. Even Moshe, 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 Moshe. What do you want? What do you want? The story of Moses in okay. the Quran. What do you want? Let us finish. Let us finish. Okay, I can't understand. Oh, I can't. We are always to talk of the Hesus, Hesus, Hesus. Okay, okay. The Hesus, what area is in the Quran? Thank you, thank you. The king and the pharaoh. They adopted that. Even most of the Egyptian name, the Hesus, adopted it. Okay. Satan, Satan. So tell me what area is there in the Quran? Okay, now. Everything. Because all the books are man-made. The Quran, the Injil, the Torah, are all man-made. Man invented all of them. They are man-made. The Torah, the Injil. They're written by people. They say it's Moses. It's not even Moses. By the way, by the way, by the way. No. Listen, listen, listen. Yeah? Yeah? Firstly, it is rude to interfere in a discussion. Oh, sorry, sorry. That's very rude. Oh, sorry. So if you be sorry, then be quiet. Okay. But don't tell lies. I'm not telling that. Just be quiet. You're not here to criticize. Okay. I'm not interested. I am. Sanusi, one of them. Okay. Sanusi, one, one second. One Jethro, second. 
Balaam, you see here. Antichrist. You, call it call it you just said sorry. You just said sorry. Bye bye. Go go. Go and tell the group of. Okay. Go in peace. Just go in peace. Okay. Okay. So people they say now here. Now going back. For example, another another significant thing, which tells you, which tells you, one of the main things that gives you that. I'm listening. No, no, I won't call up. I'm just listening. If you say a single word, no, no, I won't listen. That means I promise. you are not a man. I promise. Good. I promise. I promise. Okay. No, we have a discussion. I don't like. I could bring everyone here that could talk. If I say to them talk, they will talk. But I don't want. I don't want money. Yeah. Okay. Now another another thing which we need to know. For example, one of the things that significant error in the Bible. For example, the people, the very same people who wrote the, the, the gospel. Can you tell me who is John? The one, the one in the gospel. Who is John? John the Revelator. So he's not, he's not the, the disciple? Uh, John was uh, one of the disciples. He's not the John the Baptist? No. Oh, ah, you John see here. Rebbe. Listen, listen. John was a commander. Listen, listen. Paul was a Roman. Listen, Paul that shows me. That shows me. <laughs> Paul was a Roman again. Listen, listen. Listen, listen. Listen, listen. Paul was a Roman agent. Paul was a Roman agent. No, 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 no. No, no, no. That's not a quiz. What I'm saying. Okay. By the way. Why I'm saying this? Yeah. If listen, well, since you proved, I'm happy. you proved. No, I like you to speak. I'm, I'm very happy. No, if you like me, then be quiet. <laughs> when I interrupt, I'm happy. Sorry, sorry. Because you see, what you are talking at times, it kicks the brain. That's why I'm, I'm pumping. Like John, you are talking. All of them were commanded. Why don't you be quiet? They were rebels. John was a rebel. John was a rebel. Matthew, all of them. John was, was a Roman agent. John was the only one who wasn't killed. He wasn't killed. He was sent By the way, to no one knows who's John. He is no John. Knows no one knows who's John. John, the unknown. He is John. No one knows who's John. By the way, and that's why. Yeah, because there is no one. Because at that time, even from the tradition of the Semitic people, they will say, John, the son of such, the son of such and such, they will mention all the title of the person. No one knows, and that's why the scholars, the Christian scholars, they debate between five people about John. For example, which John is John? Which one? But definitely none of them met Jesus, except John the Baptist, who died during the lifetime of Jesus, as they say. So the point is, that tells you there is something there. So if we don't know who wrote the Bible from Jesus, meaning, we don't have an eyewitness that who wrote the Bible. Let alone, if you read in the beginning the Gospel of John, they said, this Gospel is according to John. And for people who knows English, according to John, that means someone who is writing it on behalf of John. Which means, this person is ambiguous, which means adding more. John actually wrote his own book. No. No, no, at the beginning of the Gospel, it says this book is, uh, uh, is according to John. According. All of them, the gospel, the gospel, the gospel. No, 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 the Quran. Look, look what. What's going on with you? So the companion. So. Listen, listen. Focus, focus. Listen, listen, listen. Focus, focus. No, no. The Quran. Listen, listen. The preservation of the Quran came in two ways. It was memorized, since memorized, and as well written in the same time. Memorized during the time of Muhammad peace be upon him, and as well written. It's not just only written. So that's why when they wrote the Quran, when they compiled the Quran, they brought the people who memorized the Quran to write the Quran. 
They brought people to memorize the Quran, to write the Quran. And it was tested, not just only by one person, two people, two or three. Like literally. Let me ask you a question. Yeah. How do you know the Quran is true? We put the Quran again. I answered you earlier. I put the Quran into test. We put the Quran into test. How do you know it was Angel Gabriel who gave the message? How do you know it was Again, we have, we have facts in the Quran. Historical facts. Scientific facts mentioned in the Quran. By the way, do you want to have a copy of the Quran? Yes, scientific facts. If you want to have as well to, to your wife. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. On the side, leave or the, leave the processes or the prophecies on the side. We'll give you a scientific fact. Now, 1400 years ago, what is the deepest point any diver could dive in the sea? Any diver, what is the deepest point any diver could dive in the sea? Do you think they have equipment to know what's inside in the ocean? Do they have any equipment to know what's going on inside the ocean? Yes. No, because they, they might have, because you know the Egyptians, they built these things. We didn't yeah, but, but there is no history, these things which is written and we found it. There is nothing in the history, they say someone dived in the ocean. Until lately, they discovered the submarine went, went in, into the, the depth of the ocean. So you think? By the way, you are, you, you still, you still, listen. By the way, 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 is it the norm? By the way, is it the norm to break your promises? No, let me drink this one. I'll stop it. Then go drink it and be quiet. Let me see my mom. Drink your juice. Okay, talk, everyone, talk. Can be chaos. No, one person. Is we talk, let's discuss with you. So, for example, what the people would know about cosmology? They could have learned, I mean, as much as us, because they... They, they, they weren't cosmic. Please, please. They weren't cosmic. Before Edisha went, Hank. Yeah, because no, because I just thought, of course, uh, Kaizu. IG, not you, cosmic. You know way, Listen, the, the, by the way. The way. Can someone discuss with him? He wants to talk. He is a tension seeker. Someone to talk. Brother, go talk. Go. Someone talk to him. Someone talk to him. Listen, listen. I do know because I can't focus. I, 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 I can't focus to more than one. I, that's my ability. I focus on one person. They don't know anything. I can't. I can't focus. Either you talk. If you don't want to talk, he could come in. If you want to listen, if, if it's your, which is you came first. Anyone is allowed to do what? But I am allowed. I'm, by the way, I am allowed to choose to answer, and I'm allowed to choose not to answer. Yeah. So the, I'm within my boundaries. I don't want to talk. Why, why you want to just keep someone like that? Because you say something, that, uh, and then you say, no, you can't talk. I'm no, when I finish with you, he will talk. One by one. So let's do it in this way. Otherwise, it's going to be chaos. I like things to be done in, in the right way. It's a discussion. We can have a discussion. No, we, are not, we don't have a public discussion. We have a single discussion. One to one. It has to be ordered. Otherwise, it's going to be too chaotic. It's going to be chaotic. So it's one person talks at a time. It's fine. Uh, if you wanted, listen, if you wanted to give, if you want to give your right to him and to move aside, I don't mind. If you wanted, if you are, you came here first, so you are served first. Yeah? Okay. And, and as well, it is chaos to interrupt a discussion. Again, I'm reminding you. Please. Yes. Yes. Can I ask a question? No, after we finish. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So okay. I, believe, I believe in history they had a lot of technology that, that maybe was lost. They built, they built things back in the day we don't even know how to do it today. Uh, we have, by the way, we have whatever whatever is written in the history, we have whatever we have. We know these are facts nowadays. We don't know. We don't know. No, we know what we have now. The, the pyramids, we don't know. They're still, it's, it's, they are able to do it with the mass people. There's, 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 uh, there's the cities in South America, the, what is it? The, yeah. uh, the point is, the, the point is, my, my, my point is, my point is, people at 1400 years ago, there were no one is able to dive in deep in the ocean. No one, no, we know, no one, until the submarine was discovered, until we know what's going on there, then we discover what's happening there. At that time, we didn't know. As simple as that. Now, going back to the point. As well, as well, no, as well, not just the technology, even some scientific facts here. 
God has said in the Quran, those who are away from the guidance of God, like someone deep in the ocean. Above him, there is a wave. Above the wave, there is another wave. Above the sea, there is a cloud. Even if he took his hand out of his pocket, he will be unable to see it. Darkness about darkness. So God is describing certain darkness, pitch dark, the absence of light. God could describe, this is darkness and that's it. But God described detailed one. So now we discovered this, that when the sunlight comes to earth, and if it's a cloudy weather, 40% of this light will be reflected back. And only 60% will go through. This 60%, when there is surface waves of the sea, what the surface waves does to the light, it breaks the light. And only half of that barely could go through. Now, people used to observe this surface waves until again recently discovered that underneath the surface of the sea, there is something called the sea current which is traveled by waves and as well it breaks yes yes to know without equipment yeah more than this and yeah that's my question before how do you know it was gabriel because yeah, so if you believe in Gabriel, Gabriel will not lie on Allah. He will say, bring news from Allah. I'm asking this because I say, uh, Jesus, when he was tempted in the, in the uh, wilderness, Satan came and an angel of light and quoted scripture straight off the top to him to try to tempt him. And he came with the angel of light and said that to the But obviously God counted. How do we know it was angel Gabriel? Yeah, angel Gabriel, again. Angel Gabriel doesn't deceive. Angel Gabriel will bring, we believe as Muslims. Satan, deceives. He deceives. Satan is not an angel. No, he's not an angel. No. We believe he is from the jinn, B. Allah says in the Quran, Illa Iblis Kana min al jinni fa Jinn. We believe in a devil. But that devil is from the jinn, not from the angel. The angels, again, the angels are created from the light. The devils, uh, the light. And jinn are created from fire. And human being created from clay. But, but Iblis, the devil, he was so pious. Lucifer. Yeah, like Lucifer, what you call Lucifer. Iblis, from, from fire. Yeah, which is that? And then he was so pious to the extent God has put him in the level of angels. He was at the level, at their level, but he wasn't from them. He was in the status of the angels, but he wasn't an angel by default. Yes, he was up there in the ranks. He was pious enough to be among the ranks of the angels. But he was not an angel himself. He did not fall or anything like this. He was just a different creation of Allah. And he was created to worship Allah like all the creations are. And he was raised above the ranks. But God knows. But God knows he's going to rebel. God knows that he has arrogance. God knows he has arrogance and pride. And God tested him when he created Adam, tested him, and then he failed. That that's why he is cursed. Yeah, he, he, not he fight. He didn't fight. He disobeyed God by saying he didn't prostrate to Adam. And he said to Allah, I'm better than him. You created me from fire and you created him from clay and I'm better than him. So God, he said, it's not for you to be proud. All the angels, including Iblis, to bow down to Adam, including Iblis. So what happened to him? What was his then God cursed him and, and put them down, all of them, to, to come to earth. Yes. No, they're not angels. Angels, they don't follow the misguided. They don't disobey Allah. They only do. There is no different type. No, there is no followers of Iblis. Followers mean if the followers from the jinn, his own kind, and from the human being. So the jinn are a different creation. 
God has put on earth even before human beings. Jinders, like what what do you call it? What you call it? What you call it? Spirits. Some evil spirits. They call it evil spirits. What you call it? Those are the jinn, which is made from fire. Not evil spirits. They are, we are they are jinn, not evil spirits. They are jinn. Just can they from a Christian background, the, the evil spirit can possess someone. Yes, those yeah. are the jinn. They can do that. They can, they can go into yes. the okay. in the previous time, yeah. where multiple spirits went into one person. We believe this as Muslims, that these things happen to people. They could be possessed by... People, be, people get possessed. Can the devil, can uh, go into someone? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So that's why we have to understand that he has helpers. He is like king of those, you know, uh, evil, uh, you could say, uh, evil uh, jinn. He's like their leader. So my point is, my point is, I... No, 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 no. Jinn, Iblis from the Jinn. Listen, try to understand something. Listen, Iblis is one of the Jinn, he's a member of them. Like, for example, someone, one of us, is a member of the human being. There is a human being, there is jinn being. Jinn being, at least one of them. But he was pious, he was elevated to be in the rank of the angel. Not the jinn, the leader of the evil jinn, because some of the jinn are good. Some of them are believers. There is a chapter about them, by the way, in the Quran. So what do they do? Just like us, just like human beings. They eat, they drink, and they, they reproduct, they do all like us. They live on earth. We don't know, but we live on earth. We can't see them. And there are some people who communicate with them, which is not permissible to do that in Islam. Yeah, those black magicians and these people who are dealing with evil things. So you see, there is. why don't you accept to be Muslim? Have you read the Quran? I'm reading it. I said to you that uh, how do I know that, that it, it comes from from Angel Gabriel? Put it, put it on the test. No, no, no. Iblis also knows that the, the Bible. Again, Allah. again, again. Going back to the point. Angel Gabriel will not disobey God at all, and he only will inspire what Allah told him to inspire to the, to the Prophet and Messenger of God. Understand? So that's why he is the Holy Spirit. Allah described him, he is the Holy Spirit. Ruh al-Qudus. He is the Holy Spirit. See, that's the... I think the jinn is this. See? That's what happened. Anyway, I wish you all the best. Do you have Quran? Yeah, I have this maybe. No, it's something about Islam. Anyway, thank you. Anyway, everyone, it was interesting discussion here. <laughs> thank you so much.